All right. We're going back to Suo, but they think we're rebels. When we get there, do you think they'll send the National Defense Forces or the OSF after us? Even if we do get caught, who says we won't be able to make a request to see the Chief? We'll most likely get our personalities rehabilitated before then. I thought about it, and I think it might be best to say we want to see my brother right off the bat. Yuita, that's bold. I'm sure they know we've been all over, learning secrets. My brother takes the Sumeragi name seriously. I think he'll want to persuade me to join him. Now that I'm branded a rebel, he might expect me to come crying to him. That's crazy. I'm almost certain that he's waiting for me. All right, but we should do what we can to prepare for a confrontation. Yeah, I know. I sure do hope Kaito hears you out. It'll be nice to get some new information from him as well. There's probably many things we still don't know. I agree. And he is the head of the OSF. So it is safe to say that he knows just as many secrets as the counselors. I guess if that's the case, maybe it is worth trying. What is it, Wataru? No, no it, it's just... I, I was thinking of ways I could support you from here. Anyway, don't worry about it. Okay, keep up the good work. All right, let's head out to Suo. A state of emergency has been declared in Suo. Civilians should evacuate to shelters immediately. What's going on? There aren't any soldiers. No, they're just hiding. This whole area is surrounded by the National Defense Forces. They're waiting to ambush the rebels. But something isn't right. They're definitely planning something. Even if it's a trap, all we can do is go straight in. Let's head to the OSF headquarters. Someone's coming this way. Is that... Hey, Yuito. I missed you. Nagi? What are you doing here? What am I doing here? <laughs> Just hanging out, you know? I'm here to clean the rebel filth out from the great new Himuka! Is it new Himuka's plan to make us fight Nagi? I won't do it. We don't need to fight. Nagi, run away with us! We'll find a way to undo the personality rehabilitation. If they can just change you like that, there must be a way to change you back. What? I can't go now. The fun's about to start. I'm gonna kill you and rip out your brain! Brain? Maybe he's ordered to get Yuito's brain. What? Hey, Yuito. We're friends. You'd do me a favor, wouldn't you? Give me your brain! <laughs> He's so strong. This isn't just personality rehabilitation. He's received some kind of power enhancement. Damn! Why? Why is this happening? Do we have to fight? Feel free to stand there if you don't want to fight me! I'm gonna cut off that ugly head of yours either way! Nagi! You are gonna try to fight back, right? And I wanna see you struggle. Make it more fun for me! <laughs> I feel the power coursing through my veins! It feels so good! Use my power when you can't anticipate the chakram's movement. Be on guard! Nagi's power is rapidly increasing. Any hesitation could be deadly. I won't let him kill Yuito. We're gonna stop him with everything we have. Here we go! Nagi told me that he wasn't suited to use bias. It might have been attached, no thought given to the negative effects it may have on the brain. That's awful! He's a human being! Ow, that hurts! Damn it! Yeah! Something big is coming. Watch out. 
my fault. You! I'll kill you! What happened? You just die, you Ito! Stop it! There's no reason for us to fight! Shut up, shut up, shut up! I'll kill you! I must have your brain! What's wrong? Uh, no! Shut up! Don't tell me what to do! Stop! Stop! You eat <laughs> Nagi. Yuito, 
You can't move him! Wake up! Uh, Yuito... I... Uh... Nagi... You... Are you... Yourself? Sorry... I didn't know what was happening... The voice... Said I had to... Kill you... Don't apologize, it's not your fault! It was all the people who did this to you! I... Didn't want to fight you... I tried to resist... But it hurt so much... They... Told me to kill you... That they'd kill me if I didn't... I was so scared... So I... Couldn't stop... There was nothing else I could do... Every time he resisted, they sent him to personality rehabilitation... How can they be so cruel? I'm fine, so don't be so hard on yourself. You don't have to be afraid of their threats anymore. I'll fight with you! <laughs> Yuito, you're so... How did this happen? W we were always together. Ever since we were cadets, we were finally OSF. In Seto Platoon, I thought we could still goof off together. I... I have to apologize to Captain Seto, but it's too late. <laughs> I thought that when I died, it would be more heroic, you know? Going out in a blaze of glory, fighting another. Look at me. I'm no hero. Tell me. How did I... How did I... Mess everything up so bad? Hey, Yuito. If I was gonna die either way... What... What should I have done differently, huh? Nagi! Nagi! No. no. You weren't wrong, Nagi. It was the country that did this to you. They're the ones to blame. When I didn't know what to do, you were the one who suggested we join the OSF. I said I wanted to save people, but I couldn't even protect you. I'm sorry. I will avenge you. That's a promise I can keep. Yuito? I'm fine. I hate just leaving him there. Yeah. We'll take care of him later. We have to go see my brother. He's a government official. He probably had something to do with Nagi waiting here to ambush us. No way. You think Kaito would use Nagi to get at you? I don't know. Either way, we have to meet. The National Defense Forces are surrounding the path to OSF headquarters. They haven't given up on capturing the traitors. They're probably no match for you, but be careful. Oh, and Yuito? Take it easy. Thanks, Wataru. All right, let's head to OSF headquarters. We haven't run into any interference since we got to headquarters. They must have ordered everyone out. The only person in that room is... Chief Sumeragi. So, he's waiting for me. Just like I thought. It'll be difficult supporting you going forward. Do your best talking to the Chief. You mean, the network's going to get cut off? No. I'll tell you why later. Just do your best. Got it. Will do. 
Everyone ready? Here we go. Kaito. I figured you'd come by. Yuito? I wanted to talk to the new Himuka government about Seiron, so here I am. I figured since you're with the government, you'd listen to me. Your safety has been assured for that purpose. I assume you want me to remove your status as a rebel? Before we get into that, Kaito, there's something I need to ask you. Was it you that sent Nagi after me? What if it was? <clears throat> How could... Unfortunately, he failed. We gave him so many enhancements, yet he was still a failure. Don't say that about Nagi! Yuito, I know how you feel, but... It is awful, but you must hold yourself back. Why, Kaito? Why did you do that? What did Nagi ever do? He knew about the secret of metamorphosis, so he was rehabilitated. I'm sure you know all about that. He was the perfect subject for testing power enhancement on an OSF soldier. Also, he was exactly what we needed to tame you. That power of yours. New Himuka needs the special gravikinesis power you have. I thought you'd be open to the idea if we used your friend, but you really are irritating. You did all of that to Nagi just to get my power? I wouldn't have needed to do this if you had just done what the government wanted. If you had come to me as soon as you were branded a rebel, I could have taken care of it. You've always been like this. You do whatever you want, without listening to my advice. You don't act at all like a Sumeragi. That's why Father never told you. Tell me what? That it's our destiny to fulfill the wishes of Yakumo Sumeragi. Wishes? It doesn't matter. You don't need to know. Does it have something to do with the moon? Yakumo Sumeragi was one of the first colonists from the moon. Where did you learn that? In Togetsu. We went to Togetsu and found a lot of information that New Himuka is hiding. You went to Togetsu? So that's where you disappeared to. I already told you I want to talk. If we don't stop Togetsu, New Himuka will... There isn't a single piece of information that comes out of Togetsu worth trusting. Don't tell me you've been brainwashed. Who are you calling brainwashed? We looked into what we learned in Togetsu, and we think we can trust it. Silence! You were just seduced by them without knowing Yakumo Sumeragi's noble purpose. I'll teach you some real history. We were sent to Earth, our motherland, in order to reduce the human population on the moon. Not only that, they created the Extinction Belt and sealed the colonists on Earth. What? The Extinction Belt was created by the people on the moon? Now you see just how diabolical the moon is. After much hardship, Yakumo Sumeragi created New Himuka and came to a decision that someday we would destroy the Extinction Belt and attack the moon. We inherited Yakumo Sumeragi's will, and we must exact our revenge on the moon. Revenge? That's what Yakumo wanted? Yes. It is our destiny to fulfill the Founding Father's wishes. It is that very reason New Himuka exists. Now you see what it is you must do, what your duty is as a descendant of Yakumo. If we use your gravikinesis, we can move the Extinction Belt the time has come to open the path to the moon and get our revenge! I don't have that kind of power. It's possible. If you connect to all the citizens through SAS, even if it's just a normal person's brain, with thousands, tens of thousands connected together, your brain functions will expand exponentially. By connecting so many psionics, Nuhimuka's military strength will increase rapidly. Connecting civilians to SAS? Ridiculous! Only psionics can endure that kind of pain. Whether or not they can endure it is of no importance. The only thing we need are their brains. Actually, 
It would be best to eliminate their pesky personalities, and personality rehabilitation technology makes that easy. Stop it! People aren't a means to an end, and neither am I! Kaito, it's stupid to get revenge for a 2,000-year-old grudge! I think what the people from the moon did was wrong, too. They made the extinction belt. But do you really think it's right to force civilians into this? That is the will of Yakumo Sumeragi. Yakumo this, Yakumo that, he died a long time ago. Yakumo Sumeragi is alive. What are you... He is asleep, deep beneath Suo. Even now, he is waiting for his revenge. Are you referring to cold sleep? Just like Kagura. I was shocked as well when our father first told me. And it was at that same time I realized the destiny that awaits. Grow up. There's so much you need to understand about what it means to be a Sumeragi. Destiny? Who cares? Because it's a 2,000 year old tradition? Because I'm a Sumeragi? That's just an excuse to stop yourself from thinking about it. I'll never be like you. I want to find the truth, evaluate it, and decide for myself. You'll lose the honor of our family name. I don't care. With or without the Sumeragi name, I'm still me. What? Yuito. You... I didn't think you would be so unreasonable. I suppose all I can do is force you to cooperate. I was hoping you'd listen to me, but I guess that's out of the question. Sorry, but I don't plan on getting caught now. You are betraying our father! I know I am. But I think Dad would understand. A fool. I have something important to tell you. Can you get to the safe zone? Tell me what? Uh, all right, let's just get out of here. There is no one around here. What do you want to tell him, Wataru? Shouldn't we get out of Suo and rethink our plans for now? No, I want to tell you right away. Everything the Chief just said, I was able to use the system to record the video and audio for all of it. What? Didn't you say that recording was prohibited? There are ways to get around that. It does, in fact, take a certain amount of skill, though. That's so dangerous. If you got caught, Personality rehabilitation would be the least of your worries. We were all in danger, and I covered my trail. But yeah, it was risky, so there won't be a second time. Oh, so you said you couldn't support us because you were focusing on that. You recorded the conversation with my brother. You're thinking about the keycard Fubuki gave you. If we access Arahabaki, we can send the data to everyone in New Himuka. Yeah, that's right. We can complete Major General Fubuki's mission. Then my brother... and father's name will be dragged through the dirt. Yuito... I know your family's involved, but you're not responsible for the things they've done. I respect my commander's decision, and I'm ready to take on this burden with you. We're a team. We know you have some hard decisions to make, but we all feel the same as Gemma. Allow us to help carry the burden. Thanks, guys. Honestly, I'm not sure if destroying what my father and brother built is the right thing to do. But now I know the truth, so I have to act. I know this is something I need to do. Let's go to Arahabaki. We're telling everyone what my brother and new Himuka have been hiding. All right, let's make this happen. That's it then. I pulled up a route to Arahabaki for you. Major General Fubuki sent me the data earlier. Thanks, Wataru. For that, and the video. I knew we could count on our operator. <laughs> Just doing my job. 
Okay, I've sent you the location data. Let's head there right now. I hope the key card we got from Major General Fubuki gets us through. Are we inside Arahabaki? This feels different than the place we visited on that field trip. I don't recognize it at all. It's installed below Suo. It goes down pretty far, but only the upper levels are open to the public. I believe this is the secure site where they control it. Fubuki was only allowed restricted access, so we don't know much. We should be able to access it from somewhere around here. It doesn't look like there's anyone suspicious around. But I do see that it's softly big in there. Got it. Tell me when you see something. First, let's look for an access terminal. Kaito wouldn't even listen to us about stopping the war with Seiron. It seemed like he stopped listening as soon as he heard Sogetsu was involved. He was shocked. He didn't think you'd turn against him. Yeah. I was surprised too. But I'm glad I said what I wanted to. You didn't have many opportunities to speak frankly with the chief? <laughs> Not at all. We've never been close. My brother has always followed in our father's footsteps. Unlike me. I think my brother just did what he thought was right. I still can't forgive him though. Just because you're brothers doesn't necessarily mean you understand each other. There was a lot I didn't get about my brother. Former Major General Karin seems like he's a bigger problem than my brother. <laughs> Us younger brothers have it hard. <laughs> we do. Something's coming at 10 o'clock. Is that... another? What? People use this place. What's an other doing here? I see it too. Did someone realize you were there and lure it in? Maybe... No. There's no point thinking about that. We just have to be careful. The connection is bad inside Arahabaki. It might take time for me to receive the video data. Understood. Oh. Go as fast as you can. Okay, that worked. We can move forward now. There's no way there should be others inside our Havaki, right? No. They shouldn't be in the sealed area like this. Maybe somewhere. Never mind. Use a fast one. Use SAS, Yuito. Fight speed with speed. It'll work! Oh, 
from somewhere else.
useful if it moved in the direction we wanted to go in. So frustrating that it's not. You need help? Yes, it is frustrating. Although, it does appear that running on it would be a good workout.
Is that the Arahabaki access terminal? Yuito, did you... Image... Set... Wataru? Signal... Bad... So... They might have blocked outside signals to prevent any interference. Is the video file... all right? We've come all this way and now no signal? Oh, you've got to be joking. There. Got it. Nice. Looks like it just came through. Now we just need to connect to Arahabaki and send it. Looks like another seated terminal. Should I use the access terminal? No. Let me do it. I want to do this myself. All right. But be careful. Looks like you connected fine. It looks just like the OSF system. I should be able to upload the video data. Now to send this to the minds of every citizen. Arahabaki can forcibly access and broadcast to all citizens at once. Now this data, the truth, will be seen by everyone. Man, woman, young and old alike. We don't know how everyone will react to it. We should expect the truth will probably hurt a lot of people. Yeah, you're right. I'm sure there will be people angry that I told them something they didn't want to know. Still, I want to ask everyone how they feel after knowing the truth. Dad. Kaito. I'm sorry, but this is the path I choose. to Yakumo Sumeragi's will, and we must exact our revenge on the moon. I wonder if it worked. It doesn't look like any data was sent to us. Signals are blocked here. Oh, right. The display says it's sending, though. If every new Himuka citizen is seeing this, I'm sure there's a big fuss out there. I'm sure the government is in chaos, too. They'll probably try to protect themselves first. There's likely a lot of disturbance among the soldiers as well. Fighting Seiron must seem pointless now. If the fighting between New Himuka and Seiron stops, that's one hurdle cleared. This video is a catalyst. I can't imagine how New Himuka will change. Our next task at hand is to figure out how to stop Togetsu. Let's assess the situation and then make our next plan. I think we should go outside first. Right. Others might show up too. Let's get out of here. 
Don't move a muscle. You wait too! Get out of my way. Major General? Karin, why are you here? Are you still trying to copy Yuito's power? Your surprise attack didn't work. You don't have much of a chance. I could reduce you all to ash in an instant if I wanted to. If what you need is Yuito's power, then you can't damage his brain. So what? Maybe I'll crush his limbs one by one. Yuito, give me your power if you want to remain whole. Why are you after my power? I don't need to explain myself to you. He can't be after my psychokinesis. He must know my real power. You came all this way just to take it. You must be up to something. As long as you don't tell me what that is, I'll have to fight you. You're wasting my time. You'll regret not obeying me immediately. Don't waste my time. Fighting Karin is reckless. Yeah, I'm scared. But we have to protect Yuido. What are you thinking, Karin? I don't even know who you are anymore. You don't have to know me. Get back, Luca. If you won't, you'll be eliminated. Karin. Let's go. I'm using this, Sugumi. What was that? It's even quicker and stronger than the last time we fought him. I guess the Septetrion first class never stops evolving. But we've gotten better, too. You guys good? I appreciate the help.
The number of powers he can use is incredible. You're more tenacious than I thought. I've been around a little. I'm used to fighting now. It's true that you can use many powers, Karin. But you only have one brain. You won't be able to keep up against so many. Things will not go your way for long. Just stop this! I don't want to fight anymore! Who do you think you are? You haven't won yet. Choose your words carefully. <laughs> There's no way that you can defeat me. This place is my domain. What? Am I being invaded? What's going on? My body... Uh, I can't use my power. This cable... Uh, did it come from Arahabaki? Looks like I'm in. Karin... What are you doing? My head! What is this? I feel like... I know this. It's just like when my power... resonated with Kasane's at the Kunat Highway. Yuito! What's wrong? Has his brain been eaten away? To the point where he can't talk? Is Arahabaki controlling me? I can feel someone, but who is it? My power is activating on its own. Damn, this isn't good. I can't stop it. Could this possibly be what he's after? All right. Let's try this again. Alice. He's gone. He must have teleported. No, that was... He came here... to travel through time! Ruito! Are you okay? <laughs> What is this place? I... Uh... What was I doing? What's going on? Who are you? 
Hello? Hold on. Who... am I? I don't... <sighs> I don't remember. What is... this? I'm sorry. Explaining will take too long. Just let me put this on you. You have to live. No matter what. all that just now a dream must have been an hobby <sighs> here we tell welcome back <clears throat> kasane and everyone why are you here Are you okay? Do you have a headache or feel nauseous? 
I think I'm fine. What happened? Do you remember being attacked by my brother? Yeah. Then Arahabaki invaded my mind, and I was forced to use my power. What happened after that? There was a large earthquake, and my brother disappeared at the same time you collapsed. You were holding your head and looked like you were in a lot of pain. We didn't know what to do. I think Asane Platoon got here. It was really bad when we got here. Sugumi was white as a ghost, and Hanabi was holding you and crying. Gemma and Luca both looked so pale. We were afraid you might have died. So that's what happened. But why did you come here? Karin copied my power, then went teleporting after you. It looks to me like you needed both of our powers. Our powers? The red strings? Yes. I didn't know what he was after, but I knew I had to warn you. We couldn't send signals into Arahabaki, so we came running. Wataru helped us too. You had almost lost your mind and your memory. You were in a lot of danger. I had a dream that I was slowly disappearing. I guess it was real. But then Kasane had an idea. She thought she could use our memories to reconstruct yours. Reconstruct? We tried to form you from memories we shared when connected by the SAS, and experiences we had together. We all connected our SAS cables, and sent our memories into you, as data. Memories change based on whose they are. Mixing together multiple people's memories was as dangerous as personality rehabilitation. It was honestly a gamble, but thanks to everyone working together, you miraculously woke up. I'm glad you're back. So, I could have lost everything. Which means... The memories I have now are the connections you made for me. Thanks. Your head really doesn't hurt? Is there anything you can't remember? I have my memories, and my body feels fine. If you have your memories, does that mean you have old memories as well? Even memories from before meeting us? What? Yeah, I do. Although, it's kind of strange that I'd have old memories if they all had to come from you guys. So, does that mean we were able to restore the memories beyond our own? Or is it simply luck that they weren't erased? Wait. When we all connected through the SAS, it felt like there was a transmission from an external server. Were you storing your past memories on one? No. Why would I do that? What do you even mean? I see. Then what was that? I have a feeling it was something to do with Yuito's restored old memories. It doesn't make sense that he has all his old memories back if all we did was give him ours. There is a lot to think about, but I believe it's time we leave. It's dangerous to stay here. You're right. Can you move, Yuito? Yeah, I'm okay. Kasane. You're all coming too? Yes. We have no business with our Habaki. I'm glad you're okay. Now let's get out of here. A mandatory curfew is in effect. All citizens, please remain in your homes. Do not be deceived by unverified information. Unverified information, my ass! You can't trick us anymore! Everyone, please calm down. Do not leave your domiciles without permission. The government was tricking us! Who's going to believe you now? There's more confusion than I thought. People were already on edge after Seiron's rebellion. Their reaction is completely warranted after being shown a video like that. Nagi's not here. Maybe the National Defense Forces took him. I'll have Wataru check later. I'm assuming you all saw the video as well? Yeah, we did. A lot of it was information we learned in Togetsu, but it carried more weight coming from the Chief. We used our Habaki knowing this would happen. I don't regret anything I've done. But to live with what we did, we need to change New Himuka. Someone is coming. An enemy? What? I don't believe it. Good. Finally. I've been looking for you. Major General Fubuki! I've been worried about you. We haven't seen each other since the old OSF hospital. 
Karin saved me at the last second. Next thing I noticed, Seron had taken me in. Seron? I'm glad you're alive, but it looks like you're hurt. Are you okay? Nothing to worry about. More importantly, there's something I need to tell you, Ito. Me? Togetsu has sent people after you. We managed to drive them off because we noticed their movements early enough. But there could be more next time. I want you to be careful. Wait. The whole Togetsu detachment? You took them out by yourself? I just talked. It was the Seiron forces that did the actual fighting. You got Seiron to take action? You act like that's not even a big deal. Just how in the world did you manage to even do that? I was afraid they'd not only be after Kasane, but Yuito as well. Anyway, we're finally together again. I'm sure we all have a lot to discuss, so why don't we go back to the hideout? Are you even in any condition to walk? You look pretty haggard. Perhaps I'm a little sleep deprived, but rest is not exactly an option right now. We should get somewhere safe, and... Major General! Are you okay? Don't cause a scene or you'll gather attention. He needs to rest, so let's go to my platoon's hideout for now. So this is where your hideout is. It looks like the same type of unit as our hideout. The make is identical. How is the Major General? I gave him first aid. The sedative seems to have worked, so he is resting. Looks like he overused his power. You could see the exhaustion in his face. We should let him rest. Don't worry, he's not in any real danger. He's a lot tougher than he looks. <sighs> That's good. I guess we need to wait to talk to him. So, are you guys okay sharing this hideout with everyone? It's going to be a little crowded. That would be convenient. We should sort our belongings then. Kagero, what are you going to do about Yuito? I think it's probably best we decide on something. Oh, you're going to bring that up. I guess that makes sense. I promise you I'm giving it some thought. Just give me a little more time. Oh, 